Hey guys, Brent here. Are you a photographer who needs a professional looking portfolio website? If you are, then you're going to be interested in this video. So one of the biggest questions I get from my students is how do I display my work in the best way possible? And in the old days, I had a portfolio, I still got a print portfolio where you go in and you have your best 12 images or best 20 images. But nowadays you need to have a web presence and a lot of people use social media, but social media has got, you know, all these ads and distractions and you can't really control it. You know, one day you're on Instagram, the next day they don't like you and you're off. So I highly recommend if you are a photographer and you get to that point where you want to display your images really well, you need to get a portfolio website. So I'm going to show you what I've done here, or at least what SlickPick has done for me to build my portfolio website and how cool it is. And then there's also a special deal that I managed to get with SlickPick. So stick around till the end of this video or click on the link below or above this video and get the deal that I've got for you guys. All right, so let me show you the website that SlickPick put together for me. It took them about a day, really easy. All I did was upload a few images into different albums and then they put it all together for me. So what I've done here is I've actually pointed my domain brentmailphoto.com to my portfolio website. So the front page, I've changed it. Initially they uh, had a slideshow for me, uh, but I kind of like this format where I've got all my best black and white African images on it because that's kind of who I'm targeting right now. I want to sell prints of these images. So there's my wildlife album and it shows up really beautifully over here. Wildlife, you can click on the different images, look at them large, you can do all sorts of things. You can zoom in, zoom out. You can even set it up so people can comment on your images or purchase them, which is a really cool way of making extra money. I'll show you my food album. There it is. So this is a job I did for a restaurant, a local restaurant, and I wanted to display these images in the best way possible. Beautifully, they are displayed and clean, and it works on mobile and desktop and tablets. So That's really cool. And you can put your own watermark on all your images or some of them or none of them. It's really easy to add that or take it off. And then of course, you've got to have a, an about page and a contact page. Those are the essential things for your own website. So about page is kind of who you are, what you stand for, what kind of photography you like to photograph. You can put all sorts of things in your know, links to your other websites. And then the contact page is essential too because you want people to be able to contact you to buy a print or just get in touch or send you some work. So, and you've got links to all your social channels over here. So that's it. SlickPick did this for me in about a day. And then I had a couple of changes and all I did was email them and the next day it was all done. So it's really cool. So I've managed to get a special deal from SlickPick for 25% off lifetime membership. It's at slickpick.com forward slash Brent Mail. If you go there, you'll get to a page that looks like this. It's a 25% discount for life. All you need to do is put in your name and email and they will guide you through the rest of the process, how to get involved and how to test it out. Something I forgot to mention is that SlickPick has a Lightroom, Photoshop and Adobe Bridge plugin. So you can send your images straight from Lightroom to your album in SlickPick and get it displayed on your website. That's really cool. So make sure you click the link below or above this video to get the 25% off lifetime uh, discount off the website package and the portfolio package. Go check it out. It's really cool. I highly recommend it. I'm loving this. I'm about to upload some more images into my different albums. So let me go and do that. Catch you later. Bye.